Hi children, very good morning. Today we are discussing about defects of vision and their correction. Vision. Vision means how to see the objects or anything for the form vision and the near vision by the eye. See here in the textbook what was given is Sometimes the eye may gradually lose its power of accommodation. In such conditions, the person cannot see objects distinctly and comfortably. The vision becomes blurred due to the refractive defects of the eye. See here, some of the persons cannot see the objects distinctly and comfortably. Why? Because of the persons how the eyes becomes blurred due to refractive defects of the eye. So what type of defects of vision will be there? See here, there are mainly three common refractive defects of the vision. These are myopia or near sightedness, hypermetrophia or far sightedness. Press biophia. So, three common refractive defects of the vision are one is myophia, hypermetrophia, and press biophia. Is myophia or nearsightedness, hypermetrophia or farsightedness, and press biophia. So, these defects can be corrected by the use of suitable spherical lenses. So, we know the spherical lenses. Spherical lenses are two types. One is, one is convex lens and concave lens. Which lens can be used by the correcting of the defects of the vision? We discuss below these defects and their corrections of defects of the vision. Clear? So, that means... What the lens we have to use in myophia, hypermetrophia, and presbyophia. So, there are the defects of the vision we have to use a such type of spherical lenses. The lenses may be have convex, concave, both convex and concave. What make it is? So, which lens can be used in this? Let's see the corrections of myophia hypermetrophia and presbyophia let us see see the first one myophia myophia is also known as near sightedness near sightedness means a person with myophia can see nearby objects clearly but cannot see distinct objects distinctly so, a person can see the near the objects clearly, but not far objects. Okay. So, distinct objects cannot see clearly. So, that person have myophia. A person with this defect has the far point neither than infinity. Such a person may see clearly up to distance of a few meters. After that one, he cannot see properly from that distance, how cannot see any objects. So, in a myopic eye, the image of distant object is formed in front of the retina. Actually, the image can be formed, by, formed on the retina. But here, a person who has myopic, myopia, the image can be formed at the in front of the retina. So, that persons have caused by the disease is myophia. So, and not the and not at the retina, the defect may arise due to excessive curvature of the eye lens, elongation of the eye bone. These defect can be corrected by using a concave lens so this myophia the correction of lens is concave lens those who have myophia 
the curvature which curvature the excessive curvature of the islands and eyeball is elongation eyeball is elongation so these two defects can be erased by the concave lens so this defect can be corrected by using concave lens of suitable power this is illustrated in a convex lens of suitable power will bring the image we can see in the figures see the first figure far point of myopic eye so object is a far point the object is far point but here the myopic eye the formation of image z see the in front of the retina in second figure in front of the retina in second figure so whenever we have to use the concave lens concave lens the, the image is formed at retina so this is the correction for myopic eye so those who have myopic eye they have a use of correction is concave lens concave lens see in this figure you have observed clearly whenever the object is at a distance in front of the myopic eye so the image is formed at the in front of retina the arrow mark is indicates here the focused in in front of retina and after this we used concave lens we used concave lens the lens makes rays divert slightly the focused on retina which one is focused here image is on retina so whenever those who have myopia that means short sightedness or near sightedness those who have contents have they are using concave lens the diverging lens the diverging lens is nothing but concave lens so the image is formed at at place of retina otherwise the image is in front of retina whenever the image is formed at in front of retina the image is very blurred so it is very needed by the retina that means in uh, approximately 25 cm clear so that's why the using of correction is whenever we have to keep a concave lens the eye image is formed at retina the myopic eye is vision is clearly and observed very clear so that's why the myopic eye is too long for its converging ability why it is converging ability means we have to use a concave concave lens so here defects of the human eye from the myopia short sightedness let us see here in this type of defect of vision the eyes distinctly see the objects at a near distance but are unable to see the objects placed at a far off distance so causes of myopia excessive curvature of the lens and elongation of the eyeball as a result focal length of the decreases and rays from infinity focus at a point in front of the retina remedy of myopia that means correction of myopia so using a concave lens of suitable power which brings the image back on the retina so which is which has formed in front of retina image that have to back to retina that means whenever use concave lens the image back retina so this is brief explanation of myopia or short sightedness or near sightedness see the next one hypermetrophia in the textbook what was given is here hypermetrophia is also known as far sightedness so myopia is short sightedness and hypermetrophia is far sightedness 
A person with hypermetrophia can see distant objects clearly. In myopia, short objects clearly, he can see near objects clearly, but here in hypermetrophia, distant objects clearly, but cannot see nearby objects distinctly. Nearby objects distinctly, the near point for the person is farther away from the normal near point is 25 centimeters. Such a person has to keep a reading material which is beyond 25 centimeters from the eye for comfortably reading. This is because the light rays from the closed by objects are focused at a point behind the retina. Behind the retina. Why? Beyond 25 beyond 25 centimeters, the person have clearly see the reading the book why means because of he cannot see from 25 centimeters of anything or any object so that's why he can see ability from the beyond 25 centimeters because the image is formed it beyond the retina we can see observed in figure b so the defect arises either because the focal length of the eye lens is too long focal length is eye lens is too long the eyeball has become too small focal length focal length eye lens is too long and eyeball has become too small this defect can be corrected by using convex lens this defect can be corrected by using a convex lens you observe in figure c Whenever we have to kept a convex lens, the image is formed at retina. So, the eyeglasses with converging lenses provide the additional focusing power required for forming the image on the retina. See here, you are observing clearly. When the parallel rays are distinct object, the parallel rays are from distinct object, the retina, see, the image is formed at beyond the retina that means focused behind the retina the arrow mark is indication is here and whenever we using we kept a convex lens converging of convex lens the image is formed at or focused on a retina so so this is the observation clear from hypermetrophia means long sightedness so hyper Metropic eye is too short for its converging ability. So, hypermetropic eye is too short for its converging ability. See here, in this type of defect of vision, the eyes distinctly see the objects placed at a far distance, but is unable to see the objects placed at a near distance. Causes of hypermetrophia. Focal length of the eye is too long eyeball has becomes too small as a result focal length of eye lens increases rays from near point focus at a point at the back of the retina a remedy of hypermetrophia the means correction using a convex lens of suitable power which provides the additional focusing power required to form the image on the retina so these are the brief explanation of hypermetrophia so hypermetrophia is nothing but far sightedness so here the vision is the distinct objects is a vision is clearly but near objects cannot see clearly whenever we have to keep a convex lens the near objects also vision clearly so these are the hypermetrophia those who are causing the hypermetrophia they have uses a convex lens then the image is formed it on the retina understand let's see presbyophia presbyophia means a person of those who have both myophia and hypermetrophia that persons may be have presbyophia see here the power of accommodation of the eye usually decreases with 
aging. For most people, the near point gradually recedes away. They find it difficult to see nearby objects comfortably and distinctly without corrective eyeglasses. This defect is called presbyopia. That means those who are aging persons, they are unable to see the near objects clearly. So those persons can see the objects clearly with corrective eye glasses. So this defect is called may have presbyopia. And see, it arises due to gradual weakening of the slurry muscles and diminishing flexibility of the eye lens. Sometimes a person may suffer from both myopia and hypermetrophia. So those who have suffer from the both myopia and hypermetrophia, such people often require biofocal lenses. Why they have offer biofocal lenses? Because of myopia corrective lens is concave, hypermetrophia corrective lens is convex lens. So those who have both myopia and hypermetrophia suffer it. So they can have biofocal lens. That means both concave and convex lens. So the upper portion consists of a concave lens. It facilitates distant vision. The lower point is a convex lens. It facilitates near vision. So the upper portion used by the concave lens to distinct vision. The lower point is used by the convex lens. It facilitates near vision. These days, it is possible to correct the refractive defects with the contact lenses or through surgical interventions. So that's why in press by a fear, it is possible to correct the refractive defects with the contact lens or through surgical interventions. Okay. So these are the brief explanations of hypermetrophia, myopia, press, biophia. Okay. Thank you.